hi guys my name is farin ver welcome to my channel if you're new here please don't forget to subscribe and if you're an old subscriber welcome back today we're learning how to do a minimalist intro keep watching love you so let's get straight into the video right now i'm just going to google aesthetic flowers so i just want you to be able to google it and make your choice so i'm just going to show you what my search brought out but you could do cartoon flowers i use a cartoon flower so this is what it will look like once you google aesthetic flower pictures so you could make your choice and do whatever you want to do So in order for me to get a flower and to make my own, I'm going to teach you how to make your own green screen flower, to make your flower in green screen just so that you can apply it to your video. You need it to be on the green screen background in order to apply it to your video using InShot. So I'm going to Google a green screen background download. I'm going to pick the first um, picture and I'm going to download it and then I'm going to use another app. So you need to download background eraser app you can find it on your app store and then you can erase the background i just picked this flower and then i erased the background it's much easier to use background eraser and it's free so i'm just erasing all the flowers that i was able to download from google and i'm saving them now i'm going to go to the photo place of InShot, and i'm going to write my name on the um font of my choice so I'm going to write my name, the one I want to use for the intro, and then I'm going to save the picture. I'm going to use PixArt, and I'm going to pick that particular picture that I wrote my name on, and then I'm going to go to Draw on PixArt, and I'm going to pick a color using the color picker, and I'm going to click Record on the two little papers or layers, and then I'm going to clean my name with the same color i picked carefully now you have to you have to learn this and you have to be perfect in it i'm not perfect yet but um you clean it in the backwards we're starting from the last letter to the first letter and then you're going to save it so i'm going to play it now and you're going to see i'm going to just take it to 15 seconds because i don't want it to be though your intro should be nothing more than nine seconds to me so i will come to vn vn is the app that is free and i've told you about i want to create my own green screen effect so um i'm going to pick my um green screen that i downloaded the other time and i'm going to pick one of the flowers that i'm going to use i'm going to apply it on the i can you can also use pics art and add photo but i just decided to use vn because i want to show you how important vn can be both for picture and video to make your um, your flower move and just to make it static as well so i'm going to use vn for the both of them you'll see that later so now as i've written the name i'm going to click on reverse in in short and it's going to reverse the name to make it look like i wrote it down easy peasy that's how to make your name or anything look like you're actively writing it on your intro so you're welcome the next step is to add my flower to my intro and now i'm going to go to chroma on InShots. please let me know if you want a tutorial on how to use the new InShots now because i'm going to be taking a tutorial so now i want to make my flower move i want to make it locomotive so i'm going to click on then click on the sticker that i created using background eraser and i'm going to go to motion now there's in and out animation so i'm going to use the loop animation to make it big <laughs> a little and i'm going to either increase or decrease the animation and then i'm going to save the video and apply it on InShot. i'm also going to do it for the other flower just to show you how clear it is so once i do that i'm going to use the reveal because on on our intro the flower is revealed so i'm going to make sure that you know review is going to make it more like the intro that we've created 
with respect to our actual intro video i'm going to be exchanging the flowers because it's this flower that is used in our actual intro so i'm going to be using the particular flower and i'm going to be using the chroma effect increasing the strength and increasing the shadows as well to make it look better if you really want me to do um a whole tutorial on how to use the new features on InShot. please just write them down on the comments and i will do a whole new extensive tutorial on how to use these new features because trust me they take your pictures for and your and your video editing from just meh to very professional so please let me know so we've done the first part of our intro video this is actually the second part in the arrangement but we've actually concluded the first part now i mixed it up and i thought that the instagram um logo was going to be here but it's not here this instagram logo was created with the background eraser and then i'm just going to add it to this particular part of the intro video and i'm also going to be writing my name as well my instagram name is underscore underscore ver underscore firing and i'm really sorry for the noise outside let's just focus on the tutorial and get it right right now i'm just trying to add a label to my instagram name just to create a beautiful gray effect on my name just so it is very obvious when everyone is watching the video and i'm going to pick in an awesome font also um, InShot doesn't really have so much um, fonts if you don't get them, if you don't buy them. So please make sure to get really good fonts. They are free ones. I'm going to show you how to be getting them in my extensive tutorial on how to maneuver your way through InShot. Right now, I'm going to try to create the next part of the intro video intro videos are in parts so you can't do everything at once if you want to do everything at once it's okay but you, i'm doing it in parts now i'm just going to be picking that video that i created on my vn to make my flash locomotive and i'm going to be um copying them and you're going to be seeing the effect of you know the flowers moving that's exactly what i wanted so I'm going to be increasing the flowers just to look exactly like the intro video that we have created previously. So um, forgive me if the video is not exact because it's, it's just, it's exactly how I did it, but I mixed up some very little details. So I got this particular um, green screen animation from YouTube and I'm going to be putting the link down into Creative Common and um it's very cute i really liked it so i decided to use it and because i'm going for this um um what do you call it now minimalist i'm going to make her black and white so i like the way she said hey and um i really mess with that so i really like it but there are several um animations that you can like i'm going to show you exactly where i get mine from and so that you could use them and it could be cute and it's just going to add like this little flavor to your videos i don't know this is just me so i'm just giving you an idea of what i'm doing one thing i like about this new feature of um in shot is how you can change the effect of so if it's a particular color and you don't like that color you can actually use an effect like black and white to change the color to what you like and now we're going to be doing the last part of the video which this subscribe i still got it from a channel on youtube and um yeah i it's i just want us to use it and that's what i just want to use just to fit the theme of what i'm trying to achieve here so i just use the green screen and now i'm adding all of them together all of them together just to make the video exactly what it was before and i hope you enjoyed the tutorial and i hope it was easy let me know what you want so in case you notice most of the processes to make this intro are simple and repetitive so follow this channel for more tutorials because we're going to be doing a lot of tutorials on this channel turn on your post notifications and get ready for the next video we love you so much thank you very much for watching my video like share comment and i love you bye